Um, can I get a motion to approve the agenda? So moved. Bobby? Second. All in favor say aye. Aye. Okay, we have a uh, safety moment, Jay. I do. This this one is uh, not going to take five minutes. It's more of a reminder of the time that we're in um, with the um, COVID environment. The, there's a lot of news about the vaccine, um, and I want to encourage uh, you all and uh, employees and people watching to keep on staying vigilant, stay aware of uh, what is going on. Um, be sure you're taking care of yourself. Um, we are we still have um, all of our safety protocols in place, um, but we also have somewhere in the 80 to 90 people that are isolated because of some close contact or some issue. Uh, and so it's still a, a high level um, issue and concern. Um, and I want us to just stay aware of that. Um, and then the second piece is there are things going on in the world and in the environment um, today uh, and over the last next couple of weeks that I want us to stay um, also aware of, that we've got crews that are out in public uh, a lot. We've got people coming into the community. We've got a great team of safety and security professionals that are kind of watching this. We've sent out a notice to all employees today, reminding them to be aware of their surroundings. Uh, so that's uh, the two messages, be aware of uh, the COVID environment, be aware of the safety and security, uh, and uh, thank you to those folks that are helping us with that. Appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, very, very appropriate message. Uh, the next item on the agenda is the JEA Board of Directors slate of officers, um, which is, a, of course, why we're here today. Um, there is no specific slate of officers, so I'll take uh, any nominations from the floor. John, can, can I just, yeah, can I have not only nominations, but kind of remind everybody in this unsettled world some of the things that AA has done under your leadership and with Paul and also now with Jay. But, you know, sometimes it's good to reflect on some of the things that we were able to accomplish in this past year. And I'll just walk through with some of these Um you know, the Moody's Ambassador Service upgraded us from an AA3 from an A2, rating on JEA's water and sewer senior and subordinated lien revenue bond. And thank Marty for her effort in that in that area. Um, we refunded 352 million of bonds with 78 million of present value savings. We reduced the outstanding debt by over 10%, 364 million dollars. We contribute over 118 million to the city of Jacksonville general fund. We engage with Florida power and light co-owner of plant share unit four to announce its closure at the end of, uh, CY 21 and replace with 20 year power purchase agreement, 10 year natural gas committed. The cooperation is green agreement is pro projected to up generate approximately 200 million of net present value savings and is expected to reduce JEA's power generation carbon emissions by approximately 15%. We settled the plant Vogel litigation and I give John Baker and Paul McRoy a lot of credit. Not only did we settle it, but John and Paul went up to plant Vogel and saw the site. You know, we completed the 10th consecutive year of stable or lower total JEA electric rates, the eighth consecutive year for water and sewer rates. We collected a, over 900 million of net revenue available for debt service, the city contribution and capital investment, and deployed over 380 million in capital without issuing any new debt. To me, with that being said, I think my suggestion and my motion is to keep the officers as they are. Um, John, I think you've done a fabulous job and I think it makes a lot of sense to keep this leadership in place um, the way it is. So that would be my motion. Okay. Marty, do you have any thoughts? 
Um, well, I think I made them clear in the new business section of our last meeting. So I'm very happy to second Bobby's uh, motion. Well, I appreciate y'all's uh, confidence. Uh, happy hey, Ms. Mr. Chair, bef before you respond, so the, the current um, officers right now is you as the chairman, Bobby as the vice chair, and Ms. Lanahan as the secretary. And so, Bobby, for your motion, and that's been seconded by Ms. Lanahan, that would be the slate of officers you would recommend um, to the full board? Yes, Jody. All right, thank yes. you. Thank you, Jody. Appreciate you doing that. Um, the truth be known, every one of those uh, accomplishments that you listed have the two of you all's fingerprints all over them. And I just want to thank you for all you all have done um, coming back for a second round uh, of service for JEA. And it's, it's my pleasure to serve with you. And so um, if there's no further comments, we'll, we'll vote on the motion. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Okay, it carries. Um, Jody, anything else we need to do? No, sir. Just based upon the bylaws and the um, the board document, man, the the board policy manual, the, the 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 slate of officers will be presented to the full board. And I need to go see if um, the the bylaws. It either says that the, that has to be done um, either at or before the March board meeting. Um, and I just need to clarify that. Um, it'll either go on to the next board meeting, the slate of officers to be um, approved by the full board, um, either at next month's meeting or if it's required at the March meeting. But I've got to verify that in, in the new changes that we made um, to, to clarify um, the timing. And the, the term of the office will be from April of 2021 through March of 2022. Um, you'll be in your current positions um, as officers in, until um, the end of March, and then this new slate of officers picks up on in April of 2021. And it, it's my understanding um, that Bobby's nomination to to another board seat is working through the system as described by the um, referendum. That's correct. That is correct. His term currently ends in February, but le legislation has been filed with city council. Mr. Stein or Bobby will be the, the first appointed um, by city council member of the JEA board. Um, legislation has been filed, um, and he is the appointment of the, the, as a JEA representative, and the, the unions have in, su in support of that. It is going through the process. I don't anticipate there being any issues from him being reconfirmed. Thank you for doing that, Bobby. Absolutely. Yeah, thank you, Bobby. Is there any other new business? Jay, do you have anything you want to talk about? No, no sir. I think we are good. Thank you for your service and um, look forward to working with you uh, another year. Okay. Uh, this is going to be one of our best meetings ever. <laughs> Short and sweet. Short and sweet. Thank, thank you all. Thank you, John. Thank you, John, for agreeing to serve again. I think the continuity of your leadership as we onboard Jay is really important. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate you guys. Y'all have a wonderful day. All right. Stay warm. Thanks. Bye. Bye.